everyone, welcome to Amateur Decorating Like a Pro. I am Catherine. Thanks so much for tuning in to my second blog of DIY Body. On last week, we talked about beginning a journal and getting an accountability partner. But most importantly, consulting with the physician before you begin any exercise regimen or any nutritional changes. So that's super important. And that is a disclaimer for anything that I say on this channel pertaining to dieting, quote unquote. So guys, I want to go ahead and get started with video number two. All right, so last week I began telling you about how I was going to keep a journal about my activities as well as the food that I'm eating. This is the actual sheet that was given to me during the class, so I'm going to read it off to you. Um, it is basically a wellness journal. It keeps track of my breakfast, my snack, my lunch, my afternoon snack, as well as dinner, and the times as well as the portions. It's very important that I log this information down so these bad habits that I have and you have and all of us have, that we know what's causing the weight gain and what's causing the problems with our health. And they're probably obviously eating some things that we should not be eating. And I say we, because that definitely includes me. So the thing is to also include what you're drinking. So don't forget if you're drinking sodas, water, whatever it may be, include your liquids in your journal. Now on the very back of this, it lists activities. It lists my morning, afternoon, and evening activities and the time in minutes for these activities. That's super important that you keep track of all of your activities so you'll know what's helping you to get the weight off or at what stage of activity are you? Are you an interval activity person or are you an intense activity person? Are you a casual person about getting active? But where do you stand on being active? Now with that being said, I also want to share with you a very up-to-date, shall I say, a way of keeping track of your exercises as well as your calories and without paper. Now this particular one involves Super Tracker. Super Tracker is a USDA food and nutrition site that you can find on the internet of course and they have several videos that will pilot you through their actual site and they're all on YouTube. I didn't know that until recently. Believe it or not, I found this out from the seniors in the class. That's right, the senior saints that were taking the same class that we're all taking and I'm so glad to learn something from them of this caliber. So let me show you what they taught me. Now on my phone, I have the app S Health and I'm all about there's an app for that. But these ladies were so excited about Super Tracker. And it is obviously the way that they've been going for some time now. So that's why I want to share it. Now I'm going to provide you with the link to this actual site in the comments area of this video. When you click onto this actual link, you're gonna be brought directly to this page. All of these are actual site tour videos. They're very easy to follow and they're on YouTube. Here's the fun part. Click onto the video, my top five goals, whether it's weight management, physical activity, calories, food groups, or nutrients. It's gonna be a blast. You just click and it gives you all the information that you need. You need to be honest about your input. Please let them know if you're going to have a goal or if you are simply just wanting to find nutritional information. Be honest about where you're trying to go with your health so that they can give you accurate information about what you need to do to achieve that goal. Now the great thing about Super Tracker is you can take the information that you write down and put it into the computer on Super Tracker and then take a look at it by month or by week, however you choose to set it up. And it's going to give you honest feedback, you know, what you've done. So once you put it there, it is there until you either unsubscribe from the site or delete the entry altogether. The other feature that I love about it is the actual journal itself. You're going to be able to keep track of the food that you eat, the location that you eat it, whether it's an, a restaurant that you were at or something like that, or the activity and 
the mood that you were having. Remember I talked a little bit about that you're going to be able to see if you are an emotional eater or not? Well, sometimes documenting it is the best way to see what sparked you to having that bag of popcorn in between meals. You know what I mean? Was it the fact that you were bored or was it the fact that, you know what, everybody else was eating it and you decided to just join in? So you're really going to get to know your eating habits. So take a look at that. So this week's blog is simply all about keeping track of what you're doing and finding out what your triggers are and so that you can get in control. What are your triggers? What are the reasons why you snack? What is it that gets you into eating a bag of popcorn in between meals? Is it that your favorite TV show comes on at that time? Or is it that you have, quote unquote, that eating buddy that you always have a candy bar with at noon or something like that? So we're gonna be able to track that. So give this super tracker a try. You'll see a comment on the site from me that says, why is this video listed as unlisted? Because it is a public website and and what is to deal with that because I always like to make sure that I am referring secured websites so you can take a look at it um, without enrolling in it for now and if you feel comfortable with it you can go ahead and enroll in the site and build your own journal remember if it says HTTP as it is a secure website otherwise it may or may not be secure and that is solely my opinion thanks a lot for watching this video and as always stay in prayer and stay creative and once again, consult your physician no matter what a website tells you to do. I am super excited to bring you some of my faux fur fashion knockoffs in my very next video, which will air this Friday. Thanks a lot again for watching and remember, become a subscriber today. You'll be the first to see my very next video.